And we are back. It is time for the final showdown. Vegeta versus Cell. Why Vegeta? That is a secret. Quite literally. You also get a special dialogue for it. I don't remember if you get this battle music anyway, but I like to think it's special battle music too. We are back. What do we got? This is actually a pretty hard fight with with uh, Vegeta, but I will do my damnedest to make it not too terrible. Hopefully. At least we got the good battle music this time, as opposed to the old crap. I like this battle music a lot more than I like the other battle music, if you can't tell. Oh, that's not gonna be happy. But yes, as people were noting, Endurance does guard, do does make any attack aside from, I think, command cards do half damage. So it is very good. I've already got three in my deck, so I couldn't... I've got three in my deck, so, uh... We've got as many as we can use. At least I think I've got three in there. And I have given Vegeta his new card that we picked up for him. Big Bang Attack. Takes exactly the same amount as a, uh... Whatever. S Super Kamehameha. And does the same amount of damage. Possibly more, because Vegeta's got a pretty good key stat. But anyways, in other news, I went and saw the new Indiana Jones movie today, and I really liked it. I'd recommend it if you're a fan of Indiana Jones. Shia LaBeouf, also known as uh, Sam Wickwicky from the Transformers fame, makes, an inter makes a very valiant attempt to try and steal the show as Mutt Williams. But, you know, he's up against Indiana Jones, so he doesn't quite manage to do it. Still puts up a quite a valiant effort to do so, though. He's... Ever since Transformers, he's probably gonna go places. So... And he's also not a bad actor. But I thought it was a pretty interesting movie. It didn't feel quite like the old Indiana Joneses, but... It was still pretty good. So... If you got the money and the time, I'd recommend going to see it if you could. It also inspired me to pick up the new uh, box set of the three old movies. Because I love those movies. And now I had a good reason to go and buy it. So in the end, everything worked out for everyone. Especially me. Eh, what the hell. I also have both of my cats sitting here right on my lap. Because apparently they were mad that I left them all day. So I want to say hi, guys? Yeah, didn't think so. They're not very talkative. Because they're kind of jerks. You know how that is. They're cats. They don't need to entertain you. That's what I'm here for. Oh, you jackass! Oh well, that probably just evens out the full spirit, so I guess it's not too bad. But still, how damn annoying. Fuck. Oh, well, we're in the air, at least. Okay, that's unfortunate, but, uh... We should be able to survive. Uh, he's in the... on the ground. Let's see if we can knock him into the air first. Ooh, we have an avoiding card. Perfect. Let's get rid of that. I 
Of course, if Vegeta decides not to knock him into the air, so... I'll just deal with the lesson damage by the fact that he's on the ground and use a big bang attack. I don't remember if Vegeta actually has any, uh... special physical attack cards. I don't recall ever seeing any. Oh. So I think he's stuck with just continuous kick and continuous punch, both of which kind of suck. I know Trunks has a special one, because you get it instead of burning attack when he joins. I forget what it's called, a rising kick or something like that. I don't remember the animation for it, but it's probably not all that interesting, because only a few special attack, special physicals have actual new animations to them. What do we need the least? This. Bye, Tien. You suck. Hello, Tommy. Oh, good. Cell so didn't use an endurance or do anything else dickish. Of course, since he's on the ground, that did pretty crap damage anyway, but... What can you do, I suppose? What else do we got? Da -da 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 -da. Nothing interesting. Apparently Cell's Cell combo must use up a bunch of, uh... CC. Yeah, that or... I don't know. Something. Yeah. Hey, a Foresight. Perfect. Looks like he's building up to use a pretty big key attack, probably a Super Kamehameha or something. I doubt he'll do it now. Okay, good. I was right. I'd really like it if he would get his ass off the ground, but he doesn't seem to want to do that. Anyways, let's get this out of the deck, because it's pretty crappy anyway. I don't want to just throw it away. I might as well use it to take a chunk out of him. You cock. Oh well, that brought us down to pretty much equal. And he wasted an endurance card on a pretty shitty attack, as opposed to a good one. Okay, we've got... a blocking your attack card. causing you to waste a bunch of CC. While we gather more of our own. Okay, he moved forward this time. That's helpful. Did he move up into the air? That is the question. No, he didn't. You motherfucker. I've got a feeling he used up most of his CC, so let's use this. Good call. Good call. Cell is actually proving to be one of the toughest opponents in the game this time around. I don't know why, but he's just being a giant cock. Let's keep that one in mind. Ooh, did you move up into the air? Please tell me you moved up into the air. That would make me so very happy. Oh, you did. Thank you so much, Cell. Okay, good. He's just doing a five-stage attack. We're in good shape. This will not kill us by any stretch of the imagination. And now, we return the favor by...
ideally blowing your ass straight to hell with a big bang attack. Don't even fucking think about using barrier. Thank you! So instead, die. Peace out. So we've got this, which we already have. Heart medicine, what does that do? Oh, it uh, makes a... It's very hard to use card that makes a uh, power down attempt fail on you. Or possibly might clear your uh, lowered strength status, I forget. And, of course, the avoid any beam attack card. Take your pick. Let me know, and we'll see a secret next time if I didn't fuck anything up. Later.